Hey folks, Lindewis over on Lindewis.com has a really, really cool tip on how to use invert to find missing spots or hard to find spots to clone out in Photoshop. Well, somebody's asked how you can do it in Lightroom. So here's what you do in Lightroom. Here you can see we've got a lot of dust on the floor and stuff like that. So this is just as an example shot the fix because there happens to be lots of dust on the floor. I should have brushed it before I was shooting. What you do is you come to tone curve and basically if there's already tone curve spots in it, which there probably will be, if you double click on a spot, it will delete the spot. So you're left with one at the top and the bottom. And then what you do is you just drag that up the whole way. Now you probably need to do this in one or two steps because Lightroom does have a habit of trying to jump back to where it was like that as you can see happening there. So I'm just going to bring it in slowly and what we're doing is we're going to put the zero point to 100 and not add in additional points. Amazing how this never happens when you're uh, doing it initially. And bring this down the whole way then. So what you're doing is you've created an entire negative of your image. So that means that what was a black spot now stands up as white on black which is actually much easier to see. So then you come in here by pressing Q to get the spot removal tool and you can start removing spots yourself. So as you can see the spots are much much easier to see in this case. Now the floor is obviously manky here so I'm not going to spend a lot of time. If I was actually retouching this proper I would probably just come in with a, a white brush and just paint the whole thing white or, or I would match a colour and paint it that way. But let's just show you how you can just get rid of spots. Now if we hide the spots we can see the spots are gone and then the next thing to do is if we click on a uh, point curve and we go to linear it will then jump back we can see that all of the spots that we had originally are taken away. So that would be how you would do that in Lightroom.